In today's video, I've got five facts about Mary Hunt from the series My Next Life as a Villainess slash a character analysis video. We will be going over Mary's bio, her voice actors, game route, and more. Now, a quick warning that there will be spoilers, so just a heads up. And for more weekly anime character fact videos, make sure to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss a video. Anyway, with that being said, let's roll intro and get straight into the facts. Mary is one of the main characters from the series, who made her debut in episode 2 of the anime and chapter 3 of the manga. She is the fourth daughter of Marquise Hunt, and is one of the heroine's rivals in the Atomi game Fortune Lover. When we first met Mary, she was around 8 years of age, and after the 7 year gap to the start of where the events of Fortune Lover start, Mary is 15 years old. Her exact birthday is unknown. Mary is a female with a fair skin tone. She has bright brown eyes and long, light reddish brown hair that is worn down and reaches below her shoulders. She also wears a bright orange flower and like hairband in her hair. Attire-wise, in her younger years, she wears a bright yellow dress with white frilly trimmings, an orange bow tie around her waist, pearls around her neck, and brown shoes. In her teens, Mary again wears a long dress that is yellow with white fancy trimmings, an orange short overcoat, a yellow choker, and yellow high heels. Mary is the youngest of four daughters, and from the outside, her family looks, you know, really good. Her mother is very beautiful, and Mary definitely gets her looks from her. Mary's mother isn't you know, thought of very highly due to the fact her social status is pretty low. Despite this, her father deeply loves her, and both parents of course love their four daughters just as much. Mary's three older sisters, however, do not think very highly of Mary. Things got much worse for her when her mother passed away. Because that presence wasn't there, and you know, that her father was often absent because of work, her three older sisters began to bully Mary and call her names such as low class, dirty redhead, they would steal her things and hide them, or even worse, break them. Not even the maids in the mansion would help, as they were part of the group who were not very accepting of Mary's mother because of, again, her low social status. This abuse of course affected Mary mentally, as she became scared of coming into contact with people. She was constantly frightened and would hide in the courtyard garden, as that felt like her only escape, and she felt at peace tending to the plants. Mary's Japanese voice actor is Miho Okasaki. She has voiced other characters such as Rifana in Shield Hero, Kotomi Kano from Bunny Girl Senpai, Rimuru Tempest in That Time I Got Reincarnated as a Slime, and more. Mary's English voice actor is Colleen O'Shawn Hennessy. She has voiced other characters such as Ino Yamanaka in Naruto, Neliel from Bleach, Margaret Mitchell in Bungo Stray Dogs, Anna Kushina from K, and more. In the original storyline, or Game Roots, Mary was never supposed to have come into contact with Katarina. However, in the current timeline, Mary was actually Katarina's first female friend. They of course met at the tea party when Katarina stumbled across Mary hiding in the garden and won Mary over by telling her that she had green fingers. This is a term used to refer to people who are good at gardening. Mary then latched onto Katarina and would often visit her house to of course escape her own home where her sisters were bullying her and Mary states that Katarina was always there for her when she needed her most and would feel happy when Katarina would compliment her. Mary and Katarina are obviously now very close friends and Mary has pretty much slotted right into Katarina's harem where she has said that if she was a man she would have asked for Katarina's hand in marriage. 
Right, in terms of game routes, Mary is the heroine's rival in Alan Stewart's route. Mary was a completely different rival from Katerina in which she loves Alan from the bottom of her heart and was jealous of the heroine who was gaining Alan's attention. Alan would fall in love with the heroine Maria after declaring her a rival to overcome. In Alan's happy end, Mary will hand Alan over to Maria and congratulate them while asking Maria to always support Prince Alan from now on. And it was an ending that was particularly quite sad. Now, in the bad ending, Alan ends up marrying Mary as he originally promised. But thanks for watching this, my video, five facts about Mary Hunt from the series My Next Life as a Villainess. Let me know in the comments who you would like to see next. Of course, I want to give a huge shout out to both Warwick and Animator22 for supporting me on Patreon. And don't forget to smash the like button if you enjoyed this video. Come hang out with me over on Twitch and uh, subscribe for more anime content. Till next time, my fellow weebs, peace.